Now, in other news, technology takes a compassionate turn as a New York-based company, Centron, hated with a new system that enables paralyzed patients to control computers with their brains. All thanks to an 8 mm stent implanted in the brain to detect the neutral activity. People affected with paralysis can hope to access the internet, communicate and even play games. Now, tiny brain implants have established that technology can help in improving the future of humanity, especially when it comes to tackling such medical conditions. Centron has been actively conducting medical tests to decode brain signals using their device. 63 years old, Rodney Gorham from Australia has been using the device for quite some time now. He shared his thoughts by using his eyes to pinpoint letters on the screen and clicking on words with his mind. I cannot say uh, that there has been even a single session in which he did a click and I wasn't baffled. It constantly does it. And every single time he keeps on getting better to the point where now he is and it's like so instant. I just feel like I type slower with my hands than he does with the BCI. So it's really something for me to see every single day. Many years ago, Rodney was diagnosed with ALS, which causes progressive paralysis of respiratory muscles, arms and legs. All thanks to the strenuous efforts put in by Cintron, the company, life will get a little better for Rodney and many like him. Although the technology is still far from enabling real conversations, devices like these do grant the much-needed autonomy to those affected by paralysis.